Hello friends, it's Alex with First Team Real Estate and today I'm taking you inside Costa Mesa. We're at Fuzz Saigon Pearl in the west side and we're gonna meet the founder of Fuzz Saigon Pearl and learn more about the business and what makes Fuzz Saigon Pearl great. Let's take a look inside. Hey Quan, it's a pleasure to meet you. Thank you so much for having us at Fuzz Saigon Pearl and giving us an opportunity to uh, learn a little bit more about it. No problem, Alex. Pleased to meet you. I'm glad you made it today. So, one of the questions I have is how did you decide to go ahead and found a restaurant? It's like probably a typical Asian life. I came off, I don't know if you know, but my background, I am a chiropractor by trade. I've been a chiropractor for over almost 18 years already. Wow. But I started in the restaurant business because of my wife and it was, it's kind of like a snowball effect. But we started in the restaurant business when we first opened our restaurant back in 2000. 11 at the uh, Diamond Jamboree Plaza. And from then on until today, we have a total of four Fuzz Saigon Pearls in Southern California. One is in up in LA County, where my brother and sister's handles. So what was the biggest challenge in starting a new restaurant? The biggest challenge was getting into the space, because when you go into a new plaza or anything that's a little bit like a popular pop plaza, they want a good basically resume, if you will. Sure. So we were new, but luckily, when I started the business with my partner, he was already an experienced chef, and he owned a restaurant in the past. Wow. So he took care of that department, so all I had to do was work with him and take care of the admin, financials, and legal leases. And as soon as we got in, we worked together, and I think we, um, we make a pretty good team. That makes a lot of sense. And teamwork is always, you know, what makes the dream work, right? Yes, exactly. I'm glad you think the same way. One of the questions I have for you is that, what do you enjoy most about owning a restaurant now that you've been in business, you know, some time now? Owning a restaurant, there's a lot of headaches. But at the end of the day, seeing people enjoy your food, praising your food, especially comfort food. We're not right. like a high-end Morton's or Mastro's or something like that, but when they enjoy it, they're able to feed their family, see their families enjoy it, and introduce our authentic Vietnamese traditional dishes to the community, if you will, wherever our restaurants are located. That thing that really makes me feel good. I love that. You, you're here and you're helping to feed the community. So what does the word community mean to you? For me, community, I mean, I've always been a team player. I've been a family guy growing up. I was always about team, so for me, community is like a big team, a big family. So whether we're right here in the city of Costa Mesa or nearby cities or any other cities that needs our help to work together with them, for me, community means just that. And what do you enjoy most about being part of the community? I want to become a staple in the community. That's the first thing. They say, hey man, where's the best Vietnamese pho restaurant that I could get that I could just warm my appetite on a cold, rainy day. For me, community is that I want to grow with the community. I want to have my family come out here and hang out in the community and hopefully in the future um, own more businesses or, you know, homes around here yeah, in the community yeah, yeah. and make the community more, what, what do you say in real estate, valuable? Um, it's location, location, location. Exactly. And that's what we do. So we can help you with that as well. But. One of the questions I have though is what, I know that it's Fuss Saigon Pearl, right? But you guys have other dishes on the menu. So what other dishes do you have on the menu and what is your favorite dish? Ooh, that's a very hard question. I have a lot of favorite dishes and it's true, it's Fuss Saigon Pearl. The reason why we use that pho, because a lot of people only understand pho. We also have rice dishes to vermicelli, to a lot of some Chinese influenced dishes like um, stir-fried noodles, and we have a lot of vegetarian options here, especially here in Costa Mesa. I know a lot of very health conscious younger people or customers are always into gluten-free, so most of our menu items are gluten-free, except for a couple of the uh, banh mi sandwiches, which is obviously not gluten-free. And um, we have a small, also a small dessert menu also. So what would be your favorite? Like My if you favorites. were to, I know that's a hard question, but what would be your favorite? When, I, when people ask me, I always say, look, my favorite dish is our number one pho filet mignon, even though it's pho, but I love the filet mignon because the meat just melts in my mouth. Number two is our shaken beef, which is another beef dish is that we use filet mignon cubes. Mm -hmm. 
And believe it or not, one of our best sellers is our banh mi sandwiches. That's my favorite. I, I always get grilled pork. Yeah. I know the word pork may not be as healthy <laughs> as uh, tofu or anything, but that's my favorite. Yeah, that's my go-to as well. So I can't wait to take a look in the kitchen and then we'll see how some of these things are made. Great, awesome, can't wait too. It's Alex here. Thank you so much for joining me today as we went behind the scenes and met the founder of Fuff Saigon Pearl. If you'd like to learn more about places to eat, things to do, and things to see in Costa Mesa, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification button. Let me know in the comments below which one of the three dishes you'd like to try. Once again, this is Alex with First Team Real Estate. See you on the next one as we go inside Costa Mesa.